Hey, Charles. Hey, hey, Charles, this is, hey, Charles, this is Jared with the Daily News in Bowling Green. Um, you know, you guys split with a lot tech early in the uh, Conference USA regular season slate. Um, you know, I guess, what did you learn from that series that you can take into tomorrow night's game? Oh, uh, yeah, just, just um, take care of the ball, you know. I mean, the final who was. We were upset for like one minute left. We didn't take care of the ball. Uh, we got an offensive foul on Josh. We kept shooting. It was just those men, those times, we just got to just waste time and just take care of the ball and just waste the clock, you know, just the clock, but we didn't. So we just got to learn from here and take that to the next game tomorrow. Hey, Charles, Drew Tennis from the College Heights Herald. So you have a guy like Kenneth Lofton to go up against tomorrow. So what are you going to have to do to win that matchup? Oh, man, it's not a big – I'm just going to come in and get ready to play, you know. I don't have to do what I do every game. I just stop my stop my opponent. So I just – I mean, I already watch film, so I'm just going to come in tomorrow, I'm ready to get my mindset right and just go ready to play. Hey, Charles, uh, Jared again with the Daily News. Um, you know, you guys were in Texas for quite a while with the conference tournament and that first round game. Uh, you guys were able to come back and then get a little bit of rest. You know, how beneficial do you think that was for you guys and how fresh are you heading into tomorrow night's game? I mean, it was good, you know. Uh, that was a tough N95 game we had, you know, because everybody was still uh, thinking about the, the game of loss, you know. Everybody was yeah, emotions and stuff. Just, you know, the first game was a tough game, but you know, just going back home, we got a rest, got good practice, and coming back, everybody's we're, we're fresh right now, so we're just we're ready to go. We're good. Hey, Charles, Drew Tennis again with the College Heights Herald. So, you know, you guys not having Carson Williams is will likely, you know, provide quite a challenge. What do you what do you guys need to do tomorrow to uh, make sure you guys pull out with a win? Next man up, someone's gonna step up. You know. Uh, I think I gotta do what you gotta do, and we as a uh, we as his team is supporting more the way you know. It's gonna be a, it's gonna always be our bro our brother. So I mean, there's nothing we can do about that. But I mean, next man up, so man, someone's gonna have to step up. Hey Jordan, Drew Tennis from the College High School. So uh, just going, just you know, after that that last game coming home from Frisco, how was that break physically and mentally for you guys? Because, you know, going back tomorrow to play another game, how was that break? Uh, I think we need that, that break, you know, get our minds right and uh, get our bodies well rested. You know, in Frisco, we was playing, that was three games in three days. So, you know, just taking that time mentally, uh, shake off that loss, and uh, just get ready for this NIT run. Hey, Jordan. Uh, Jared with the Daily News. News, you know, you guys beat them in the first regular season meeting. Then you got off to a very slow start, and um, the second one ended up losing that game. weren't able to come back. You know, from that series earlier in the year and, and pretty early January, I guess. What did you learn from that that you can take away into tomorrow night's game? I just gotta come out every game the same way. Uh, come out being mentally prepared and all that. And uh, the second game, we didn't come out how we did the first game, and it and it uh, it hurt us. You know, without having Carson um, last game, he's a guy that started all 27 games before that, I believe. Um, you know, I guess what kind of adjustment was that for you guys and how comfortable, you know, are you going into tomorrow night's game, you know, with a game under your belt without Carson? Um, it wasn't really that big of an adjustment, I would say. I think uh, we just had to rebound more as a team. I, uh, all the guards had to go help rebound. And, uh, you know, we can push the pace faster because we got Josh at the floor, so it's definitely kind of an advantage for us. Hey, Jordan, Drew Tennis again with the College Heights Herald. So, you know, just looking back at that January, those January games against La Tech, um, and, you know, you guys split that series. Um, what are you guys going to have to do uh, defensively to make sure you guys come out with a win? Um, I would say everybody just do a, a good job of uh, keeping that man out the paint. And uh, not having to rely on help defense a lot, uh, just take that that uh, challenge of stopping your man from scoring.
All right, thanks guys. Thanks, Jordan.